What's up, chat? What's up, YouTube? This is the Needed Podcast, episode 94. 94, I talked about it last week. Who is the best 94 you guys ever seen? Uh, maybe DeMarcus Ware is the first 94 that comes to my mind. Uh, but honestly, we only have this seven more episodes where we can actually talk about numbers right now. As my man Postma Jones come through with the five gifted, and my man Philly B with the three months with the tier one. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it, man. So this episode 94 now, uh, I just watched the EA stream. I hope you guys watched it. I'm super excited about Mutt. I got a couple of other announcements for you guys we want to talk about today. But I appreciate all you guys being here. I appreciate you guys that watch this on YouTube. I promise we're going to keep this going uh, all through Madden 21. I'm super excited. We're going to talk about a lot about this Mutt stream today, man. We really are. We're going to talk about the power rankings going into Madden 21. Which my man Jesse brought to him. That's a good topic he brought up the other day. So we're gonna talk about that as well. So um the biggest news, honestly, from this much stream. Now you guys are talking about it now. It is I I would say everything I got from the much stream was a thousand percent positive, right? Like I saw a bunch of new names. I saw they said Asante Samuel. I saw Adrian Wilson and Adelius Thomas are absolute animals. They are absolute animals in Madden. Both of them are huge, fast, physical players. Can't wait to get those guys on my football team. Uh, so Bob Sanders. Uh, Bob Sanders. No, Bob Sanders not that good. But now Ed McCaffrey, that's pretty much the biggest. Bro, that was one of the biggest names that I saw. Um all the layouts look awesome. The card art was kind of explained. Uh, and when we look at the card art, I mean, it, it. after them actually explaining it, okay, we understand it. You know, as much as we complain, we need the card art, we need the card art, we need the boo. Everything looked good. Honestly, um, this got me super excited to play the game. A bit, uh, what about, oh, wait, wait, a Takeo Spikes? Dog, right? Look, Rich Gannon, I'm telling you, who else, what other? So everything looked really tough. Super excited to play the game. Um, for me, and then one of the biggest things, these ability caps. The ability caps, I, I took it as each ability will have a salary. You know, you can't just have three pass rush elites anymore. Pass rush elite might be five ability points. You know, so, so and we'll see more. Honestly, it's something that I want to go and, and put on the game. And I actually want to see how it works, honestly. Because... Those guys explaining it, uh, I, I, I can't lie, I was not super locked into everything they were saying because if I it, I wasn't super locked in, to be honest. And for them to try to explain it was a little rough, but I'm assuming every ability has a point system where Reach Elite might be one ability point and then Pass Rush Elite might be five, and you can only have ten on defense and offense. That's actually super tough. That's actually super tough. You know, um, it's going to lower like super overpower abilities like pass rush elite, like enforcer. Maybe you won't see somebody with three enforcers on the field anymore or two enforcers. Maybe there'll only be one enforcer on the field. You know, so the ability points for me were probably the biggest surprise. Like we didn't hear anything about that. Uh, and, and it came out of nowhere. So I think it's going to be super duper duper tough. My man, AJ with the tier one, man, nine months. What's up, AJ? How are you? I don't think you can have three. I think I think they mentioned that it actively, actively you can only still have three players active. That's that's the that's what I got from it. Uh, it if honestly I've always thought abilities should have a cap like that and then have the ability if I want ten people if I want ten people with just secure tackler and nothing else I should be able to do that if it fits within my ability cap. I shouldn't be limited to just three players that are active. You know. Yeah, if, if Tackle Supreme is three points out of ten, you know, if I have two Tackle Supremes, I'm halfway done my abilities, really. Uh, and that's without Enforcer. That's so, so I think abilities on Mutt are going to be super duper duper calmed down. I really do. My man Andy right here with the 17 months. Thanks, Andy. I appreciate it. So I think abilities are going to be tuned down. So all you guys that hated abilities and abilities, room man, I think it's going to be super, super tuned down. Uh, kind of like regs is in that 
Um, there's only a few guys on the field with abilities, and, and they don't have five abilities each, or they don't have three abilities each. They're going to have, you might see, you know, three or four abilities on each side of the ball. That's it. You know, so it's going to be really unique to see how people use that. Uh, another thing to really talk about and tweak the team with these ability points, I think it's definitely a great idea. Uh, yeah, MCS should go full mutt, uh, I think. But then the salary cap, honestly, is... It's, nah, we'll see. We'll see. It's it's something like you can talk about it. You can try to predict it. You can try to get a feel for it. But until you have the game, it's really not. You really don't know, right? And that's what the first five months of man are. You know. So that's pretty much how I feel about it. But I'm super excited. Um, like I said, Ed makes tons of free cards. Let's just be honest. Tons of free cards, right? That's all I heard about this this rivals. First of all, let me let me let me adamantly adamantly say this. If you ever replace an S with a Z in the word, that's a super L. That's a, so when I saw rivals with a Z, oh that was a L. That that was a super L. Always a, always a L when you replace an S with a Z. It's always a L. It was cool. It might have been cool like in 1991. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so I honestly, I really do feel like there's a lot of good free cards, right? Yeah, it's a lot of good free cards, and at the end of the day, I mean, you, it's hard to complain about free cards. Now, uh, Andre Johnson is the level master. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. I believe, uh, I believe rookie. I believe level master is what Tory Holt was. And I, I would assume Andre Johnson is going to be a little bit better Tory Holt just because he's a bigger body. He's a bigger body. Um, and and you know how man is it works. So the Andre Johnson is tough. Now the Sam Mills was the mutt master. Now they went from uh who was the the first guy they talked about? I know they talked about um What's it called? Uh, Pat Tillman, obviously losing his life over in the Middle East and in the Army or Marines, whatever he was in. Uh, I'm sorry, I really don't know for sure, but I know he lost his life over there in the Middle East, and uh, that was his like adversity. Uh, who was the other guy they had? Uh, Shazier, but they they had they have this theme of somebody obviously um, people with adversity in their lives and everything like that. Uh, no. Not Alex Smith. Was this was Sean Taylor Mutt Master? Yeah, everybody that goes along. And and honestly, the theme is cool. I'm cool with the theme. Sam Mills obviously had cancer and just kept fighting through that and continued to play. And that's dope. Now, Sam Mills is 5'9". That is the downside of Sam Mills. And and most of the time, honestly, you guys don't know it. And, and what I realized today is the Mutt community is not older than 18 years old. I, so that's what I realized. The Mutt community that watches those streams and everything... They're not older than 18 because they had no idea who Sam Mills was. Um, yeah, Junior Sa Junior Seau. No, um, so for me, uh, listen, Muttmaster, Muttmaster really, I never thought Tillman would be good. Honestly, the abilities are what made Tillman good. If Tillman never had abilities, um, he would have never played. You know, and because abilities are in the game, if Sam Mills is the first linebacker to get Enforcer and Lurker, and, and whatever other abilities linebackers can have, that avalanche ability. If Sam Mills is the first one to get that, he is going to be a dog. He is, right? So, And that's essentially what it turns into. The, the Mutt Master is only as good as they make the card. You know, if Sam Mills is going to have 82 speed when, when Bobby Wagner has 79 speed, it's not that big a deal. If Devin White is four points faster than Sam Mills, he's never going to be good. But if the reverse is true, which they have all the control in the world to make this card better than all the other ones, then he will be very viable, you know? So it just depends on how they make the card. No, Tillman was always good. And this was a, Tillman was useless after New Year's, so he was the best card for six months. For free. What is wrong with, like, how was that bad? Like, what? The best card in the game, which Tillman was for the first six months of the game, was free. Like they have to, they they have to juice the card. It's not exciting. I, I don't know, man. 
If he's ADA speed, like right away, is that what he get? Oh, if, if you get Mutt Master, you you won't be able to have five pass rush elites. Fen, what's up, man? Yeah, there's a lot of speed. Now, I, I I really did want. To, I really started looking at the cards. I really started looking at the cards now. Let's see if we can look at these cards right now, boys. Um, boom, boom. Oh, we can. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. These are the cards. Now, all I did, all I did was. Now, this is not a regular ass card. This Simmons card is not a regular ass card. Let's agree with this. This is not. This is the core rookie master. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means, but uh, this dude is a monster. Like this, this is this is Tyreek Hill. He's the same speed as Tyreek Hill. There's no way this card is a day one card. Yo, yo, Isaiah Simmons is not day one though. All you gotta do is collect all the rookie cards and you get him. So what? So we gotta make sure, bro. Oh yeah, if Simmons will definitely be better than Sam Mills, one million percent. So if I get every single rookie, I get Isaiah Simmons. All right, yeah, we're ripping two thousand bucks, boys. This card's ridiculous. Six four ninety speed. He's the same speed as Tyreek Hill, and he's one cap, and his card art is crazy. Yeah, the him being a safety is the best. Honestly, him being a safety, and I just said this to somebody on Twitter, him being a safety is really the best, uh, really the best position he could be because he can play corner, he can play outside linebacker, he can play um, safety, he can play every he can play every position for the most part, unless you're in a three four or something. Um, yeah, Tyree Kill. I just searched. I just went on here and searched ADA speed and, and higher. Lamar. I don't know Jeremy Chin. This is a rookie. Yo, I never heard of this guy. He looks like a monster. The Chin Man? I know this dude, AJ Terrell, I believe is a rookie. Am I wrong or right? 6190 speed. He's a, how do I get these dudes? These two cards look like must haves. Justin Jefferson has ADA speed. Jerry Judy has ADA speed. Cam Akers. What position is this guy? Where does it say his position? Oh, halfback. Running back. Ugh. Terrell Edmonds, 89 speed. Like, team builders are they're the best cards. How do you get the team builders? Are they going to daily dose of Madden with the Twitch Prime? Thank you, man. Solos, and I get one. I get to pick one person. Yeah, I guess I won't have. These cards are too good to not play solos, though. No, but for real, like, th this card, like, even Trey Wayne's being 90 speed. Like there's no other card that comes close to that. You know what I'm saying? Like it it it's it's kind of like Apke. Yeah, Apke is a day one guy as always. He's only six one now though. I swear Apke loses a height a height every a point of height every day, or every uh what you call it. Eight games. Well, listen. I mean, I, I don't know. I think you should be able to get these cards, like, head-to-head -head or something. I don't know. Henry Ruggs actually has 89 speed, along with Goodwin, Marquise Brown, and John Ross. They're all the same card. You know, here you look. I mean, Ruggs, Ruggs might be the one. Yeah, Ruggs has 70 catch, 80, 66 catch in traffic. 85 jump. He's 5'11". Ruggs is definitely the best option here. 24 cap. Best option. Miko Harmon. Yeah, Ruggs is the best. Ruggs is must-have card, honestly. Yeah. So this is just the fast cards I really, uh, really took a look at, honestly. What are my eagles looking like, boys? 
Fletcher Cox, Brandon Brooks, Kelsey. Zach Ertz has eight. I feel like Zach Ertz with 80 speed is kind of fast for Mutt, for Zach Ertz, really. My man's real right there with the Twitch Prime. Thank you. Andre Dillard is an 84 overall. Oh, that's the team builder one. Also, that's what the Eagles got for team builder. Yo, this dude retired. I was kind of pissed because this dude, Jatavius Brown, I was hyped to get him, but then he retired, and I was a little upset about that, honestly. Because I was hyped because he was a fast linebacker, but he retired. Lane, always a monster. Darius Slay, 86 speed. I'm not mad about this. Oh, well, what Zach Ertz is this? Oh, the Rivals. Rivals. Rivals, Zach Ertz. D-Jack, 87 speed. I'll be honest with you. I don't think there's a receiver in NFL fast other than Tyreek Hill. I'll give you Tyreek Hill, then I'm going to Deshaun Jackson. I don't care about, I do not care about some stupid ass uh, rugs or Hollywood Brown. Deshaun Jackson is, a, bro, I honestly, no. I, I, I honestly have no, I've always felt, no, I really don't think there's a receiver that plays faster than Deshaun Jackson. I honestly would tell you Deshaun Jackson is is uh, what, probably one of the top 10 fastest playing wide receivers on the field, like of all time. Playing on the field, Deshaun Jackson is super fast. And and it, and, it, and it's and it's and honestly, this is what I'm saying. Honestly, he has a 50-yard touchdown. So he's like number one all time, dude. Seriously. Like seriously, Deshaun Jackson like 50-yard bombs, touchdowns. He's like number one all time. Hester is somebody that was super fast. But this is the thing. I feel like, and there we go. Maybe the deep route running. Maybe the deep route running is something he should get boosted on because Hester is fast, but he never translated to wide receiver. Like Deshaun Jackson, as far as being a fast deep receiver, it's honestly really not close to him. I mean, Tyree Kill, I mean, is above anybody else. But yeah, like Deshaun Jackson has never. Let's be honest, Deshaun Jackson has never had the credit he deserves on Madden ever, ever, ever. Can we just uh, kind of agree to that? I'm not going to like we can't we don't have to agree that he's one of the fastest ever, but he's never got the respect he's got on Madden. Carson Wentz is a gold. The disrespect. Uh, my man, Nikel Roby Coleman, Jake Elliott, kick power eighty. Al Sean, Miles Sanders, 82 speed, the disrespect. All right, what team we looking at, boys? What team we looking at? Give me a team. Give me a team. Let's see. Let's see the Cowboys. I know they stroked the Cowboys over there at EA. They just half of them. I hate this team captain shit. Oh, my God. All right, Ezekiel Elliott. 84. All right. Let, let, let me just start right here. Ezekiel Elliott is 84 speed and Miles Sanders is 82 speed. I feel like we got, I feel like there it is right there. That's all I needed to see. Like, Miles Sanders is faster than Ezekiel Elliott. Ezekiel Elliott is probably still top three running back in the NFL, but Miles Sanders is faster than him. That's, I'm just being honest. And he's, and he's definitely not two points slower than, than Ezekiel Elliott. Jalen Smith's on Twitch. Uh, Madden Rivals. Tony Romo in the game? Okay. I, I didn't get the, Was this on the... Was this on the... Uh, prom, I, I missed like five minutes of the... Uh, five minutes of the... Uh, the stream. Did I miss Tony Romo being in the game? I feel like this is tough. Mark Cooper. I mean, Lyle, Lyle Collins is an elite. Blake Jarwin is an 80. Oh, this team builder's card. I was ready to... So Blake Jar, oh my God, I'm, I don't want to get started with the cow. I don't even like looking at the Cowboys. Like, so Dak Prescott is an 82. So Dak Prescott's an 82 overall, and Carson Wentz is a 79. I'm, I, I'm just, I, I just, I mean, you, I just. 
a little disappointed. That's all. I'm just a little disappointed. Now, this is what I want to say. Who are the best safeties? Because I, I, as who are the best safeties, boys? What do you guys think? Harrison Smith, 81 speed. Ronnie Lott. I don't. How do I get this card? Jesus, dog. I play like their games. This card is tough. 85 speed out the gate. Oh my bad. I'm a little. I can't even scroll up. Tyron Matthew, 84 speed. Chin. Grant Delpit. Okay. This is a this guy. Oh, number team builder card. Jesus, these team builder cards are geeked. How can I get multiple team builders? Ronnie Harrison, CFM God, Terrell Edmonds. Bro, team builders, honestly, team builders are team builders are really the best. Team builders really are the best cards ever. Jamal Adams looks pretty good for core. He's the only core elite that's any good. 85 speed. That's shoot. Oh, and Derwin James. I think you gotta have Jamal and Derwin. Oh, Ed Reed is back. That's good. Adrian Amos will always be a solid card, right? Adrian Amos, 86 speed. He'll just always be solid. Where is Minka? I don't even see him. Did I, did I scroll by him? Oh, there he is. Minka Fitzpatrick, 84 speed. Malcolm Jenkins, 80 speed. Feels bad, man. Keanu Neal. Justin Reed. There it is. 86 speed. 23 cap. Steel. Buddha, 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 Buddha. Landon Collins. Is it gold? Oh, team builders, bro. Team builders. No, nah, team builder. I don't know how to get team builders, but it seems like that's going to be the best way to. Team builders is a. Uh... Yeah, let's go see running back, bro. Because I want to laugh at how much better Ezekiel Elliott is than every other card. Christian McCaffrey has 85 speed. Henry has 85 speed. Not bad. Eddie George card looks pretty geeked, I'll be honest. Here we go. Nick Chubb, 80. Ooh, Adrian Peterson, that card looks tough. DeAndre Swift, 86 speed. Yo, the Team Builders cards are it. Bro. I, that's all I need to see. How do I get Team Builders? That's literally all I need to see is how to get Team Builders. So Saquon Barkley and Ezekiel Elliott are the same speed. Okay. Okay. Now, Chad, does anybody in here, does anybody over here believe that Ezekiel Elliott and Saquon Barkley are the same speed? Talk to me. Does anybody think that? Alvin Kamara is it? all right. Chat, here we go. Who's faster, Alvin Kamara or Ezekiel Elliott? Who you guys got, Alvin Kamara, Ezekiel Elliott? Speed, speed. Most is it? Most third is fast. He's eighty six. I feel like that's not bad. Who's the fastest running back? Who do you guys think is the fastest? Matthew Breda, 86. Mostert's 86. Cam Akers. This card is 88 speed. Oh, what do we think, boys? What are we thinking? What are we thinking here? 
What are we thinking, man? All right, reason best what they say. Oh, well, Ze Zeke been in the league long as hell. Tiger Hill has 90 speed. Uh, this team builders are too good. So, is there sprinter? Like, is there confirmed sprinter? Are we going to go over 100 speed? Bro, if there's sprinter, listen. Agent K. Bro, if there is sprinter and we don't go over 100 speed, that's a super L. Right? That's just how I feel. I will have Tyree kill. I'm not playing until we get Tyree killed, boys. I mean, it's not... We just have to go over 100. That, that's the key to the game. Is can we get over 100? That That's how I feel. Bro, I'm going to buy Tyree Kill. Eduardo, do you know who you're talking to? This is the all money spent, spent team. I, I, I honestly am interested to see how actually I'm going to get these team builders. Because... From what we see, the team builders are the best players, and it's not even close. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel. Yeah, Mike Jack. So, I, how can I get team builders? Bro, I'm getting that, that Adrian Peterson card. That card is tough. The Adrian Peterson card. That, uh, what's it? NFL Epics. Those cards are tough. Are they, uh... Oh, real? Snag down, snag down. You'll have Tyree Kill for free? Good job, you fucking nerd. Good job, bro. Bro, we are... My man Vision with the 12 months. A whole year for my man Visions. Thank you. A power up doesn't matter if they get sprinter. Yeah, call. I can't wait to get that Jack Young Blood, bro. Can't wait to get that Jack. I might get that Jack day one. Jack Young Blood gameplay day one. Honestly, I feel like this too, chat. I feel like the team builders are so good that like I don't think you should be able to have ten of them. I feel like it should be able. You should be able to pick one person, like team captains, almost. Jack Youngblood, yeah, I can't wait for that, bro. I will tell you what. Of all the cards I saw, Jack Youngblood probably was. I I forgot he was there, honestly. Bro, I this team builder thing has me a little upset when I think about it. The team builder thing has me a little bit upset. It does. Why? Because I feel like I'm going to have to play solos. And and I feel like who was the team builder last year? Give me the t give me like give me like I just, I don't really know. Oh, Kittle? Oh, that card? I didn't even really, I didn't do any of those. I remember those cards. Okay. Yeah, I didn't have any of those cards. None of those cards were that good. Slay was pretty good. I think I had Slay. I think I did eventually get the Kittle. But I feel like I could have... Did I do solos for those? I really don't remember. I don't remember. I don't know how I got them. I think I didn't do them until they let me buy them with training. There's no way I played... I There's no way I played 16 solos. But these these team builders are so much better than the base cards. Like they're so much better than the base cards. So I feel like if you're gonna play Mutt, I feel like you have to do it. 
Like, your team is going to suck. You can spend $2,000 and your team is going to suck if you don't play these solos to get team builders. And that, to me, is depressing. Man, it doesn't matter their abilities if they're four points faster on whatever they're doing. This is bad. This is bad for me right now. I'm I'm kind of actually depressed looking at how much better those cards are. If I can use training on day one. But it's kind of like if they don't have power-ups, how can you use training? I don't understand. I'm lost. I got I got to see the game. Last year team builders were not for sets, bro. Anything, yo, listen, anything that requires sets, them shit's got to go. Or anything that requires solos. Now, I feel like you should have the option. You should use training or you could use you play solos. That way we be, we fight both battles, right? No money spent teams can be tough if they are tough, if that makes sense. Yes, yeah, still house for I'm pretty sure. No no, I'm not a big rookie premier type of guy. Who was my did I do a rookie premier? Who did I get? Oh I got Akuda. Akuda. Is he good? He's gonna be ass. Watch they made him ass. I promise you, watch this scumbag game. Watch this scumbag game. He's gonna be so ass. He's gonna be so bad. Because these cocksuckers gave him to us for free. He's going to be ass, bro. Yeah, I'm telling you, he's going he's gonna to be ass. I don't even know yet. Is he tough? Is my question. Well, it doesn't look like he has 86 speed. Okay, well, let me feel. I don't even want to look at the chat because you guys are going to hurt my feelings and tell me that he's not good. Pat Pete, 84 speed, dog. Let me find this Akuda guy. Let me find this Akuda guy. I'm not looking at the chat. Let me find this Akuda scum. I'm telling you, you're going to scum us. He's going to be trash. Is he not here? Did I miss him? I had to miss him, bro. He was like a top two pick. I mean, no way he's worse than Greedy Williams. All right, I'm done. I'm done. Jeff. Ain't that his name, Jeff? What the f what? I thought his name was Jeff. I thought his name was Jeff. What's his first name? I'm really going to chat. I thought his name was Jeff Akuda. Jeffrey? Oh, it would have popped up. Jeffrey? I thought his name was Jeffrey. Yeah, too bad they don't give you fucking losers by belts for, for working mudhead. I really didn't think there was that many corners. Is he not 84 speed? Is that is that my problem I'm having right now? Bro, if he's not 84 speed, I'm 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 He's not! He's I told you! I told you! He's not 84 speed! What? 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 I told you! I told you! I told you they would scum us! I that's what the problem was! I told you guys they were gonna scum us! I told you, man! I told you they would make him trash because the card is free. Cause we all already have the card. Oh my god! I oh my gosh! I thought there was no way he was under 84 speed. Oh my god, dude. I it was worse than I thought. I tell you they scum, they scum you. They literally scum you. They scum you for that, man. 
Oh, that was just scum. That was scum. Oh, the scum tactics. Oh, my gosh. Oh, man. Oh, that was rough. That was rough. No way Chase Young is bad, bro. I, I Okay, Grizz, I'm aware of who Isaiah Simmons is, bro. I'm aware. And honestly, I'll say this again. Safety is the best position they could have put him at because he can play safety, he can play corner, and linebacker. Oh, that was rough, man. Now, rookie premiere is literally they give you a version of his card. Whatever version his card is in the game, you get that for free, right? And the worst part is they end it in, like, Christmas. So when there's, like, a, a rookie, like, Chase Young, Chase Young at the end of the year, that's 99, they won't give you that one. Yeah, that was rough. I can't believe, I, I can't believe that he, uh... Team builders, bro, team builders shouldn't be out day one. Anybody agree with me? Your team builders should not be out day one. That's kind of how I feel. I feel, I feel like I feel like team builders have made every other card pointless. Like like core elites are ass, really. Like honestly, if if team builders are out day one, then Tyree Kill really No, seriously. If 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 t if team builders are out day one, Tyree Kill is not worth 500k. Tyree Kill is only worth that much if there's no nobody that can run with him. Yeah. Yeah, but there's corners that can run with him. If if your whole secondary is 90 speed, Tyree Kill is not worth 500k, dude. Sorry, <laughs> it's not. Now if your secondary is at 85 speed, yeah, Tyree Kill is worth 500k. Yeah, you got Trey Wayne, all them 90 speed dudes. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Yeah, okay. Okay, Eduardo, you have fun with the 84 speed. Everybody has 70 zone. There's nobody with with a high zone. We want Earl Thomas? Yeah, Earl Thomas is going to cover Tyreek Hill perfectly, bro. He's going to lock him up, man. Earl Thomas, play recognition, zone. Fuck out of here, bro. Get you, yo, yo, you go get Earl Thomas and Eric Weddle. And who? <laughs> Malcolm Jenkins got good zone, bro. Yeah, y'all are fucking lost. Then they make comments like this. They make comments, but they, they just they haven't played the game. We haven't played the game yet. And they're just making comments. Jack Youngblood. Yo, that Jack Young. Yo, I'm, it's official. Jack Youngblood, day one, gameplay. That's the second Jack Youngblood that came in here and said Jack Youngblood. He's on the team. He's confirmed on the team. Madden 21, day one. Jack Youngblood. Seventy nine speed. Yup, he's gonna be a dog, bro. I listen. Speed has to go over a hundred. I the, speed has to go over a hundred, or Madden has failed. Honestly. Unless they literally, like, don't raise the speed at all. Because they could raise the speed a little more gradually. But, you know. Fix man speed. Oh, Ed McCaffrey is must cop instantly. He's an instant pick for me. He's instant pick. But overall, I would say all the news was super positive. You know. You know, I, I feel like everything was good. Everything was uh, I'm it just I'm more excited than I was three hours ago. Put it that way, I'm more excited than I was three hours ago. That's how I feel. I don't know about you guys. I'm ready to play, especially with this Ed McCaffrey. Especially with this Ed McCaffrey, he's going to be a dog. He's going to be a monster. 
No, I'm taking Ed McCaffrey over Tyreek Hill. The new cards, yes, I did see I can get Eddie George with Eagles Chem, which is always good, uh, you know. But if we're going to go out here, if we're going to go out here with the, uh, the, the, the we're gonna like you said, 99 speed by October for sure. Eddie McCaffrey has 85 speed. That's I feel like that's pretty fast for right away. Yeah, we saw the theme builders. I they can't be that much. I, I'm I'm disappointed that they're that much better. Like core elites are ass. Which core elites will play on my team? Honestly, that's the biggest question. What core elites play on my team? I don't know. You guys tell me. Tyreek, Lamar, Pat Pete. Pat Pete got to play safety now because there's 90 speed corners already. Denzel Ward, Deion Jones, and eh, maybe he's tough. Deion Jones is 84 speed. I don't know. We'll see. I think the core elites are pretty trash, honestly. But we'll never know till we play the game. We'll never. Like I said, the biggest thing that oh, everybody's make all these. Oh, this card sucks. This card's gonna, bro. I thought we all thought Tillman was gonna be trash. We did. I don't care. There's nobody that said Pat Tillman's going to be the best card in the game. Not a single person this time last year thought that Tillman would be the best card in the game. Not a single one of you assholes. And he was the best card until Taylor Mays came out. He was the best safety until Taylor Mays came out. The whole year. So who really knows how these cards are going to play, really? We'll see. You know... I got to play the rivals. We definitely got to play the rivals. But all right, I want to talk to you guys about a couple announcements that I have. A couple a couple different groups that have, you know, upped their efforts to really uh, support me and my cause going forward with this man thing. And the first is Players Lounge, man. Players Lounge is going to become the first official sponsor of the Needed Gaming Podcast. Boom. Every single Tuesday night, we're going to be doing a lot more streams on Players Lounge along with uh, two $500 sub-tournaments each month. Each month, we're going to have a PlayStation tournament, and we're going to have an Xbox tournament for $500. Now, I might just do once a month. We'll do one month Xbox, one month PlayStation. Every single month, $1,000 sub-tournament for you guys. Um, so I'm excited about that. We're also going to have tons of nights where I play Players Lounge, and we, we do some wagers and everything like that. So... If you guys want to get on Players Lounge, if you want to check it out, those links are below, both in the YouTube and on my panels uh, on Twitch. If you're on the PC right now, you can check out my panels as well. Um, a PC tournament. Nick Neck Tat. Would you like a PC tournament? They're also going to continue to sponsor the Needed Gaming Invitational that will happen in the summertime when Madden is dying down. Um, so, I mean, so I'm super excited about that. Weekend. See, do I go do a weekend? That's what I'm saying. Uh, honestly, we'll definitely work on what's the best way to do sub tournaments. We're gonna have tons of them all year. Um, if you're sub to this channel, you'll have the opportunity to play in those tournaments for free. If you want to play on players' lounge, I'm telling you, it's the best way to play and the easiest time to play is the first month. Nobody knows the game. Nobody knows the cheesy plays. Nobody knows the best offense, the best defense. You really just get on there and play football, play Madden, and you get experience. For playing some high pressure games so when these tournaments happen that we're going to talk about uh later in the show and, and and definitely later next week when they do a mcs announcement uh you'll be ready for that so players now is the best place to do that so make sure you hit my links in the youtube or you hit my links in my panels i actually drop one in the chat right now as well so you guys can hit that link right there and check it out man because it's going to make you a better player and we're playing a lot more yeah, we're going to have Madden Mobile tournaments and PC tournaments. But is PC tournaments something you guys could want? 
Uh, is PC tournaments a PC Madden tournament? Would it be popping? I feel like people would hack like shit on PC Madden tournaments. <laughs> I need to start hacking on PC Madden. Hacks, yeah. <laughs> Yo, all of a sudden, <laughs> all of a sudden, you want to do an interception? No, but for I'm thinking a thousand dollar tournament each month on PlayStation or on Xbox, really. You know what? It, what about a yard sub tournament, chat? Would y'all vibe with a yard sub tournament? That might be hell. That might be hell. Yes, yeah, so we definitely gotta do that. A great iron tournament. Yo, that might be hell. Honestly. But I'll put it together. I'll figure out the best way to do the sub tournaments. Um, uh, so that's my job to figure out the best way to do it and do production. Now I don't know if I want to go all out with the production like it was for the uh, the needed invitational. I feel like I gotta kind of keep the needed invitational kind of special. You know what I'm saying. So, but we'll see. We'll see what's the best. Uh, we'll make sure we do. Uh, we get the best. Uh, Things to get going right there, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, alright, the next comment I told you guys is, is I've been, uh, this whole summer I've been thinking, uh, what's the best, uh, energy drink for me to, I'm a man of Kevin right there with the 18 months, my guy, thank you. I've been looking what's the best energy drink to go ahead and drink for playing Madden, right? This is a, a time where I'm going to try to be up for 18, listen. For 18 hours at a time. I've already started it. I've already been up. Shoot, I, I really haven't, you know, really supported anything. I tried to bang. I tried, obviously, every Red Bull, every monster. I'm, I'm honestly, to be honest, I'm a fan of pretty much all of them, man. But with quarantine, I promise, man, I, I really try to get in shape. I've been on this keto for like two months now. I haven't eaten bread or sugar or rice or pasta or any for two months. Literally two months. Now, I feel a lot better. I feel a lot lighter. You know what I'm saying? So for me, uh, for me, I reached out and get this company, Gamersubs, reached out to me. And it's honestly the best. I have, no, it's the best option for the health wise, the nutrients and everything you get into it. That's one thing that attracted me to. I got on I got on my bugs and I really tried to look into the health, all the things that these different energy drinks have in them that g -Subs does not. And, and, and Gamersubs for me had the most and we'll take a look at it so you guys you know we're not going i'm not going to bluff you guys i've never bluffed you in my life now we go over here right you know what i'm saying it is keto friendly man low carb and ketogenic diets and that's that's the best way for if you're if you want to lose a lot of weight i feel like keto is the best way to do it not really the best to keep it off once you lose it but it helps you get in a lot better shape i do like coffee coffee is pretty is pretty good but these, for me, uh, no calories. It has the nootropics, the things that get you really thinking and stuff like that. Uh, organic, the caffeine, all these things. There's no fillers. A lot of times with these energy drinks and everything, you get a lot of fillers, especially. And, and if you shake out the drink, you let it sit, and you get back to it, you see just a, a layer of film on the bottom. Uh, so for me, uh, that, that's pretty much why I wanted to go. And then the biggest thing, it's the cheapest one out there. It is. You get one of these tubs and it's a hundred dollars, bro. It's a hundred dollars for one of these, for real, for real. And for me, uh, oh, not a hundred dollars, a hundred servings. Let me relax. A hundred servings. You get one of these joints for a hundred servings. A hundred servings. Now, most most uh, energy drinks that come in these is like thirty servings or anything like that. I was bugging for the hundred. I was bugging. I was bugging. It's a hundred servings, not a hundred dollars. I believe these are like forty bucks for one of these. Uh, we can go ahead and take a look. For, no, it's what thirty five dollars. Thirty five dollars, you get a hundred servings. So, I did think a hundred was cheap. So you go ahead and check it out. Now I have a bunch of different codes. Um, you can get free samples for free. Let me show you these. Just because y'all in here, you know what I'm saying? You can get the free samples for me. This will make you a whole drink, two servings. This will make you two drinks for free ninety nine. Right? Free ninety nine. I'm saying free 99, there's nothing wrong with free 99. So that's what I suggest you guys do. You know, I'm not going to suggest you guys buy anything. You guys go ahead, get the free 99. We have two different codes, right? If you want to just get the free 99, which, I mean, you know, you guys are scum. 
you're going to go in there and you're going to type in needed us free all right let me hit you with this this is the code for the for the free 99 version Cause y'all and y'all gonna get and you gonna get you gonna get this this joint right here. This is what you are gonna get. This is gonna be it right here. Boom. And if you want to use and if you actually want to cop, you get ten percent off right here. Boom. Ten percent off. I I need links. I got y'all, man. This is what I do. And you get ten percent. Like I said, so essentially you'll get this for thirty dollars. A hundred servings that's 30 cents 30 cents per serving so 30 cents for an energy drink uh, energy drinks in the store are three dollars the flavors are you guys like flavors people are you guys I, I don't know I've never really been like oh I want that flavor I, I've never really been that person I, I, and so for me that's not something that really like if for me for me personally, like I've never been like, oh, they don't have the flavors I want. I don't know. I I, I pretty much like every flavor. I guess that goes to being with fat. You kind of like every single flavor. I don't know. Maybe you guys are different than me. But for me, I mean, what fl what flavor what flavors could they have that you know what I'm saying that that you guys wouldn't like? And that's the only code you need. You go in there, use that code. Use need it at the checkout or use need it US free for your 10% off or your free samples. Yeah, for real. Like, I've never been like, oh, well, I only like raspberry. Now, the ones they have, obviously, we got blue raspberry, we got dragon fruit, and we got lemonade. So, for me, blue raspberry, fruit punch, and lemonade. Yeah, you know I'm saying? So all I do now, I'm not a shaker cup person. I feel like shaker cups are for nerds. That's just I'm just being honest. I don't know if you guys use a shaker cup. Are you guys are you guys a shaker cup type of people? Not me, not myself. You know, I feel like I feel like all I do is I get this little water. I'm not a shaker cup person. No. I'm not, yeah, shaker cups are for nerds. I just get a water, or water, as you guys say. There's no way y'all really use a shaker cup. Yeah, or I, or I do a shot of the powder, but normally, water. And you take, you take, you know what I'm saying? You get the little scoop. Like I said, and on top of that, bro, the scoop of this is so much smaller than the scoop of anything else. It's just a little bit you put in there. That's all. It's not a lot. A lot of these joints, like you get a scooper, it's like this big. You need that much of the, the that much stuff in there. Yeah, I don't do scoopers. Yeah, it's just a little bit. You feel me, Eduardo? You're not putting a lot of trash. You're not putting a lot of trash out there. It's not a lot of fillers. All right, now here we go with the now my, the Sani's not good enough for y'all. How, how many you gotta feel it? Honestly, I sometimes I go with I go two scoops. Sometimes I go crazy, but for me the one scoop is the best because it's a light flavor. You know what I'm saying I'm not I'm not a big like. How is the Sani the worst? I'm just, honestly I just go get whichever one. I really I'm not a water snob, bro. I'm really not a water snob. I'm definitely not a water snob. I've never, I've never got to the point where water, I've noticed the difference. Cause I've come to the conclusion that, uh, I've come to the conclusion that all oh, water is the same, bro. Water is water. I don't think I've ever, I don't think I've ever, um, utilized uh, a water and been like oh that one's good and i don't think i've ever gotten sick from drinking water all right jesse since you're the caffeine expert 
fucking nerd, bro. Nerd. Fiji? I, I, I've I never been like, oh, what are taste better? I, I, yeah, I, I never thought that. Because most of the time, I just kill the water real quick. If it's if it's just straight water, I'll just kill it real quick. I don't know. I go there and get the you know literally the first water pack that gets there or whichever one's on sale. You know you go to the store. Do you guys buy the store brand the store brand water because it's free? Not free, but it's like one dollar for thirty eight waters. Facts, Nuke. Kirkland. Kirkland brand don't miss. I'm be real. I'm gonna be real. Kirkland is fire. And that's what I mean. You go get the Kirkland, the case of water for Kirkland. But I haven't gone to Costco in a while. I haven't done some Costco. I don't know. Sad, that's what I'm saying. They killed me. They went in there and killed me over it. I don't understand, bro. I don't understand why I got killed. I didn't, I, I never said one water is better than the other. Yes, Party Boy Kevin, better than Bang. One, but see me, myself, I'm not a big bash of other people. I like I like Bang. It's cool, but you know, it's just way cheaper. I was buying a, a eight pack of Bang for like $30. And get it delivered, honestly. And for these, I get I get I get a hundred of these, a hundred of these, for thirty bucks. And like I said, dry scoop it. Relax, Jesse. This is not. You know what I'm saying, dry scoop it. Bangs are not a dollar at Costco. Shut up. But anyway, like I said, man, I, and this company was really interested in myself and continue to grow together, and it is on the uptick. You know, like I said, so I, I we started talking about other stuff. It really, it, we, we Jay Hart, we started being, you know what I'm saying? We started being a community. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. I thought we, I, I felt like we started being squad, but you know what? Fuck y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm, 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 over, I'm over the chat now. I'm over the chat. My man, Monty. Oh, there he is. Monty right there with the tier one. Thank you, man. And it's no bang that's $1.25. I, actually, I think bang is some cheap shit. I'm big on water. I'm, like, I'm doing all right, man. Gamer subs. There it is with the Twitch Prime. So make sure y'all check that out. Here go the link, man. Dev, you already know, man. You already know. KD, what's up, man? How you, man? But anyway, let's talk about these power rankings. So I want you guys to check that out. Like I said, man, you get the free samples if you just go in there and you type needed US free. That's all you got to type. And trust me, I will be telling you guys this as Madden 21 rolls around a lot. Kevin, I'm probably down 20 pounds from the beginning of quarantine. I probably got 20 pounds more to go. But I haven't eaten. You know what makes me mad, though, Kevin, too, is that I have not eaten anything like fat in like two months. I feel like I should be 190 pounds, bro. I feel like I should be 190 pounds the way I haven't eaten anything. Bro, artists, we, we talked about a lot about mutt. And we talked a lot about it, bro. I'm number one on the power rankings, bro. Yeah, Jesse, that's all it is. But I've been eating good, really. Nah, not enough, Kev, honestly. Just walking and all that stuff. Walking around. I have no problem with keto. The biggest problem is having the food, really. I, I really haven't been working out like I should. Most, most I do is lift, that's all. I gotta do a little more. Honestly. Alright, see, I can't eat rice, Luke. See, you're just saying anything. But anyway, that is probably the number one reason I went with the gamer subs. It's more healthy, if that makes sense. All right, we just going crazy. Crazy with the questions, boys. Where are we at now? All right, let's get to these power rankings, man. Let's get to these power rankings brought to you by Jesse. 
I don't like to give Jesse too much credit, but he did come up with this idea for the power rankings. And these are my power rankings. So I don't want you guys to tell me if I'm wrong. All right, this is what we're going to do. We're not going to just come in here and tell me if I'm wrong. How about that? I'm saying that that's what we're not going to do here. All right, chat? That's what's not going to happen. We're not just going to go here and tell me I'm wrong. Because I'm right. Because these are my power rankings. All right? These are my power rankings, boys. Simple and plain. This list is... No one can argue with this list. All right? And if you have an argument, let me know in the chat. All right? So, I did top 10. Top 10. We're, no. My top 10. We're starting with number 10. Number 10 in my power rankings. Going into Man 21. This is the MCS power rankings. Number 10. I got Henry. I got Henry. Feel like he had a really good rookie season. Chat. Feel like Henry had a really good rookie season. Feel like his, his potential is through the roof. And I got him number 10 on my I got him number 10 on my power rankings. Where where would Henry go on the power rankings? Where would Henry go on the power rankings? I mean, the list is hell. The list is hell. Henry is 10. Relax. Henry should be four or five. Settle down. Settle down. Settle down. All right? You already know. John, John, I'm number one, baby. Number nine, my man Bugs. Boom. Now, y'all going to laugh. Now, y'all going to laugh. My man Bugs, the most consistent player. Bro, Bugs has been the most consistent MCS player in five years. Why is this biased? Bugs has a good year every year. Bro, y'all gonna stop hating on Bugs, bro. How is he not on the power rankings? Bugs has a good year every single year, bro. No, Canes, no, the fuck he doesn't. What, Canes? But no, Bugs has 11 something. Stop it. Bugs has like 11 live events. Canes, you don't have 11 live events? What? Y'all are tripping, bro. Y'all tripping. Y'all tripping. Can't you have eight live events? Boogs has, yo, Boogs has the most. The most of anybody, bro. Bro, y'all tripping. Y'all, yo, Boogs, Boogs is tough. Bro, yeah, <laughs> Bugs, I'm telling you, but yo, y'all tripping, y'all tripping on Bugs, and it's my fault because I make fun of Bugs too much. But that ass, and he don't tell y'all how good he is. But Bugs been putting in super work. Yeah, I'm betting Bugs over everybody day one. Fuck y'all, tired of y'all. I'm tired of shit. My next list, Skimbo, number eight. Now that's cause. He, now, honestly, if you ask me, Boogs should always be, I mean, Skimbo should always be top three. I'm just being honest. But he kind of had a little, he didn't make the last event last year. So his power rankings, he's a little lower in the power rankings. He's a little lower. Honestly, can y'all agree or disagree? Talk to me. How, like, seriously. How can he not, you know what I'm saying? I feel like that's, I feel like Skimbo should, I honestly feel like he should always be top three. But he had a little off here, so I put him at eight. You know what I'm saying? Number seven, I got J Wall. Why I have J Wall? J Wall's been dominating this entire offseason. He's been going off. He had a decent year. If you asked him, it was probably disappointing the whole year. But I feel like he's been completely dominating since the end of the MCS. Being honest, who's Hank? Just be, I feel like his momentum, I feel like his momentum he's been carrying has really moved him up this uh, this entire power rankings for me, bro. 
I'm just being honest. He has a lot of momentum right now. Wesley, I'm going to be honest. You're not on the fucking list. I'll tell you right now. There's six more people, and you're not fucking one of them, Wesley. So there you go. So I'm just going to tell you now. That's it. That's it. I'm just telling you right now. And honestly, and here's the best part. Here's the best part. As I looked at my list, Wesley, because you were 10. You were 10, but then I said, you know what? I got to put bugs on the list. So fuck Wesley, and I took Wesley off. <laughs> so that's pretty much how it worked. So fuck ya. There we go. Number six. You see? You see, Dot Machine? You see? No, I'm just saying, Wesley. But uh, as as Madden players, we cannot ignore Jay Wall's been kind of going off in this offseason. He's got a lot of momentum right now. He's probably the hottest name. It's been the offseason, but he's still been frying. I'm just being honest. And I see that. You know, I see all these little tournaments in the offseason. I see all I see all this shit. I see it all and I acknowledge it. And he's been doing very well, honestly. Alright, then we might okay, we might as well not have a list then. Fuck it. Like, hey, momentum doesn't carry over. Like, y'all are fucking idiots. Number six, I got D-Croft. Lost in the Man Bowl. Continue to get it. He gets better and better every single year. Uh, Man Bowl runner-up. So, for me, definitely improved player. So, I mean, for me, I would say, and I honestly feel like, I don't know if I, like, when I've played, I've always felt like J-Wall was probably the the best out of those guys. I don't when I've played them. But I feel like obviously D Croft made the the finals of Man Bowl, so definitely feel like uh I'm saying so I felt like D Croft D Croft is right there. Top five five is Kiv. Five is Kiv. I feel like Kiv won some games like uh, I feel like Kiv, um, Kiv is like Skimbo should just be top five of power rankings pretty much in, in every year, honestly. I'm definitely number one. Y'all already know this. I feel like Nanyako or Kiv is definitely top five. Don't, I, and, 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 and he goes right along with Skimbo in that, you know, nobody really, uh, doesn't really matter too much what they did last year, but... Well, listen, how about this, you cocksuckers? When y'all have y'all own show, y'all can y'all can pretty much make any list y'all want. And I'll be sure to tune in and tell you it's fucking wrong. Bugs is over you. All right, you know what I'm saying? Damn. Number four, I got Drenny. Once Drenny, Kiv, and Skimbo could be top five every single list for me, honestly. Yeah, if, if Kiv would have ran goal line, he'd have won every tournament. Fancy, much like Wesley, is not on the list. Number three, Clef the God. Clef is a dog. I think we, we honestly, we, uh, honestly, I feel like Clef, and I tell Clef this all the time when we talk and all, I tell him, don't worry about the belt. It's going to happen eventually. Um, oh, my God. So, for me, Clef is uh Clef is absolutely on the way to get a belt. Number two, Pavin. Probably uh, I want to say probably the most uh, uh probably the most impressive offensive player last year for me for sure. And and number one is Joke of course. Kim coming off a dominant Madden twenty performance. You know what I'm saying. Volt. No, I don't have Volt on the list. Wu, I mean, y'all just joking. Pavin, I mean, nobody can be over joke. Yeah, where's Wesley? Wesley is, is let me show y'all where Wesley is down here. Matter of fact, I can just, I can do this. This is where Wesley is. It's where Wesley is, down here. Down here. That's where Wesley is. No, honestly, I, I, these are just the players I think. Uh, if I had a little ranking list, this, this might where be where I go. You know what I'm saying? No one, but we'll know it. I mean, Noah could probably be up here somewhere. 
Bullock's got to be on the list, bro. Honorable mentions. I'm not an honorable mention man. You know what I'm saying? That's not really my... You know what I'm saying? The little man is going to make every live event, but I'm, I'm still not putting him top 10 on my power link, power rankings. I feel like my list is strong. 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 Yep. Three belt winners from last year did not make my list. Fuck them. Thank you, Dark Side. Appreciate it. Noah's gonna be good. He plays the game a lot. He's he's not gonna just all of a sudden be ass. Now we gotta be top three over Clef and Pavin? Over Clef and Pavin? Wow. So if I, so this was my original list. I had Wesley at, at ten and Henry at nine. Then I booted uh I boot <laughs> I booted Wesley. <laughs> you know why? I booted Wesley, honestly. Yo. I booted Wesley just so we could laugh at him. (laughs) 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 I I, I knew Wesley being here. I'm like, yeah, let's get him out of here, bro. All right, so so we're arguing about my bottom five. I mean, it's I guess it's my fault, bro. Because I'm kind of a what have you done for me lately person. And not that that matters with bugs or skin bugs. <laughs> but Henry, honestly, when I think about Henry... He had a great year, but I mean, the first thing I think about really is like, uh, is that kick, <laughs> that kickoff against Decroft and then letting Clef come back and beat him, really. That's all. No, Henry's a monster. Henry's a monster for sure, bro. I'm going to reveal my Madden Mount Rushmore. I got, I got, I got to do my graphic for my Madden Mount Rushmore like joke. I got it. I'm, 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 I might post it tonight. Bro, there's no way y'all have anybody over Pavin. Yo, Pavin, Pavin is tough as shit, bro. Pavin is over Henry. I don't know what. My Mad Mount Mount Rushmore. Nope, Gene's not on my Mount Rushmore, bro. Pavin, bro, yeah, like, what, like, y'all are tripping, bro, my Mount Rushmore is going to be hell, I'm going to drop it on Twitter, bro, I honestly, I need to do my graphic, honestly, no, I ain't shit, why y'all be asking about bum-ass players, I hate when y'all do that shit, where's Niner, where's Siwoo, Where's Monkey? Like, bro, that, like, that shit's not funny. I don't know why y'all think that's funny. Like, I hate when y'all do that shit. Earl is never going to be on this list. Wu is never going to be on a list like this. Fucking Monkey's never going to be on a list like that. It's, it's just not... I hate when y'all do that shit. Yeah, Reggie going to... No, I see now. And now, Joke, when it was Boog's birthday, Joke reminded me that Boog's could beat my, my record of being the oldest major winner ever. And I really kind of don't want that to happen, you know, because I that's kind of my biggest calling card right now is that I am the oldest major winner of all time, you know, I, and I feel like I feel strongly about that. 
Facts, Vert, you feel me? Well, I see this list is hell, bro. Like, I honestly, Wesley, when I look at this list and I think who is Wesley going to have a better Madden 21 than on this list, and I really can't figure it out. Like, I don't know who, like, Wesley, and ask me this, like, who, would you bet Wesley had not playing one game of Madden or a best of seven for, who is going to have a better Madden 21 on this list? Wesley or anybody on this list? <laughs> Top 50. No, nah, what's no? Nah, he don't care, but he care. If that makes sense, like, like he not losing sleep, but he definitely want to cap. <laughs> like, if y'all took a bet right now for your lives, who is going to make more MCS money next year, Wesley or Bugs? Y'all would pick Wesley over Bugs. Seriously, your life, your life on it. Who is going to make more money in Madden 21 on MCS? Boogs or Wesley? Now, I ask you this right now. There's never been a year where Wesley has made more money than Boogs. Oh, you want to do top 50? Wesley, settle down. Bullets history, don't lie. Sleeper picks? I don't know. Top 25 list. I mean, the next people on my list would be Wesley and Fancy and probably, I got to put Noah there. Uh, Mo and Noah and Little Man. Uh, I don't know. One great user. Volt. Volt got... I mean, Volt's going to be a pain to play the game every year, honestly. He's going to be good because he plays so much and he grinds. Skimble's already on the list, Javi. No, I'm, I'm going to release my Madden Mount Rushmore. I mean, I could make it right now, if we're being honest. I could make the Madden Mount Rushmore right now. But y'all just gotta give me y'all gotta just give me a second. You know what I'm saying? Now who is your mad in Mount Rushmore chat? Talk to me. Who would you guys pick for Mad in Mount Rushmore? Facts for Linklish, I like it. 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 Post, I like it. I need to see more dub dots, bro. I need to see more dub dot w's, honestly. I'm a pioneer. Thanks, Cap. I like it. That that that's pretty much, that's pretty much what I thought should have been. Uh, that's 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 my Mount Rushmore, honestly. All right, <laughs> all right, kid. Who's delivery? <laughs> Deliverance. Damn, bro. 
Woo! Ah, yo. Dan Rue? All right. Yeah. <laughs> y'all All right. Who would y'all... <laughs> Prime's done a lot. Prime's done more than all of us will ever do, bro, honestly. It's crazy, bro. The whole world is just like... Yeah, all y'all remember is last year or last week or last... Or last uh, last year, last week, everything. Y'all don't remember nothing. that Y'all don't know no history. Joff, my guy. What's up, man? That's a good list in the cut. That's a good list right there, honestly. That's a good list. You know, I'm not the not the one to knock a lot of people's lists. All right, I'm gonna finish this Mount Rushmore. I'm gonna finish it off stream because I gotta take my time because this, this this my Mount Rushmore gonna my, my graphics gonna be fire I promise. You feel me? I need more Mount Rushmore, man. Yeah, pony. If, if you think Moe's over Skimbo, you're that's you're insane. Facts, dark side facts. Lethal, that's what they tell me. I feel stiff not that old, bro. He just look old. Lethal, that's all. Stiff just he just look old. Stiff they said stiff is back. That's what I heard. Stiff is back. Alright, pony. Who is delivery? Kiv? Deliverance? We not gonna disrespect deliverance on a list like that. Yo, Kiv, who is delivery? <laughs> Hold on. Deliverance? <laughs> nah, we ain't gonna disrespect deliverance and put him on a list with Earl and them. Nah, Kiv, that's disrespectful, bro. Nah. Thank you, Mr. Ass. I appreciate it. PK. Nah, nah. Don't you dis Nah, Kiv, you disrespecting the deliverance. Deliverance actually made a lot of good runs and, and made a lot of good. He won. I think he won a club series every year. That's his name, it's Mr. Ass, dude's hell. Addy cards. Yeah, exactly. Bro, why, who called him delivery? When did I miss that? Like, why did anybody ever call him delivery? Yeah, like three straight clubs, that's tough. And he made some runs, honestly, he ain't just been getting popped. I don't know. <laughs> Delivery. <laughs> that shit is funny. Uh, Delivery. Earl, stop it, bro. Earl, have you downloaded Gridiron yet? We need a center that, that knows his role, bro. Because I'm going to do whatever I, whatever I can. I'm going to give my best effort. My best foot forward. Who's the Rocky? Bugs. <laughs> Bugs might be the Rocky. Hold on. Bugs is the Rocky, but he ain't win the last fight yet. If that makes sense. You know how Rocky always got his ass beat, but he always wound up winning the last fight? Bugs ain't winning. Bugs, Bugs Rocky movie, a long ass movie, bro. It's a long ass movie. We ain't get to the end yet. We've been in like a five year movie. We ain't get to the end yet. <laughs> bro. I don't know why y'all be disrespecting Bugs, man. Like, bro. Bugs got it. Bugs got, bro. Bugs is not no damn radio, bro. That's like Little Man. Little Man is radio, bro. All 
Uh, I have no idea when 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 I have no idea when EA Access drops. I just hope somebody calls my phone. That's all. And that's what it's like. Who? All right, I ain't even want to disrespect Bugs and compare him to Little Man and ask you guys who had the better, who has better MCS career, Little Man or Bugs? Bugs, bro, Bugs is Rocky, because when he win the belt, it's going to be like when Rocky beat uh, Apollo Creed. Little man's been solid, but Bugs has had, bro, I'm telling you, but, bro, I swear to God, bro, I really got to spend a whole year not making fun of Bugs, bro. I'm not making fun of none of my friends. Madden 21, I'm not making fun of none of my friends. I'm really just going to make fun of Kiv and Wesley and them, that's all. And joke. I'm not making fun of none of my friends. Because y'all think it's cool to make fun of Bugs. Because Bugs jokes is easy because I've laid out the blueprint. That's my problem. I've laid out the blueprint for Bugs jokes. Right? So everybody can just follow that blueprint and it's easy. I tried, Pony. I tried before the man boy. I think he went 0-3, bro. So I ain't doing that again. Anything is possible. Nah, Kep, I, I, bro. <laughs> Honestly, Kep was crazy. Yo, I swear I had this talk every two weeks with y'all. I'm not making fun of Bugs this year. This shit just too easy, bro. It's just like, bro, it's too, it's, bro, it's too hard not to tell jokes. It's too hard. It's, it's too hard not to tell jokes. I've been trying so hard since like. Bro, Man 17, that the end of Man 17, I'm like, bro, no more Bugs jokes. Boom. No more Bugs jokes. Bro, and there's no reason to roast Bugs. Like, bro, Bugs like the best guy. Like, he's legit like the best human. Like, for, and I don't know why we'd be killing him so much. Bro, I don't understand. I'm telling Bugs over Wesley though. Y'all got y'all got y'all got Bugs chop. No Duff, the jokes will not stop. The jokes will not stop. Bugs could win ten belts in a row. Them jokes not gonna stop, bro. Jokes don't stop. Top 10 bum players. Kitty, stop it. But all right, I'm about to work on my I'm about to work on my Mount Rushmore and drop it on Twitter, bro. About to. Jesse. Bro, you're black with a widow's peak, bro. That's that's that can't happen. You're the only black guy with a widow's peak. <clears throat> Mert, you know why it's not easy to roast me? Because I can't be out roasted ever by anybody. I can't be out roasted. Mert, it's easy to roast, but you know what's going to happen. You know what's going to happen, Mert. No, it, Mert, they know what's going to happen when they roast me. They're going to get their feelings hurt. They know that, Mert. You know what I'm saying? They know they're going to get their feelings hurt. That's why they don't cross that bridge. They see the bridge, right? The bridge is easy to cross. Yo, it's like Call of Duty. When you go by the dam, right? That bridge is easy to cross, but you know somebody's going to be on the other side. You know what I'm saying? Somebody's going to be on the other side. And they know what's going to happen. Nah, we ain't bringing that command back. That's on dead, bro. Actually, I'm deleting all commands, man, 21. It's a new, it's a new regime around here, all right? It's a new regime. Nah, they're gonna get they gonna get roasted. I'm telling you, bro. I'm surprised. Jesse next on the list to get his feelings hurt. He's next on the list. Bro, Juan, you are the most under bro, Juan, you are ass. Juan. You are ass, Juan. Like Juan. Like well, I hope you're staying safe, though, man. Hope you hope you good out there in the quarantine, Juan. I'll be thinking about you, man. Making sure you're cool, man. Just 
Jesus. Yeah, I'm I'm done roasting people. Just too good at it. Juan, you still owe people money? I see. I don't. I didn't believe that Juan still owes people money. I didn't think it was like possible for him to still owe people money. Oh, Portland kind of going off a little bit, huh? Okay. Oh my God, Juan. Juan, at this rate, bro. At this rate, you like. Juan. Ain't nobody playing Juan. Juan resume isn't. Juan resume is like Juan. I, that ass. Yo, Juan and Niner have a similar resume. Seriously. Like when you look at the resumes, Earl Juan. Who's the better Niner fan? I don't know. I'm only playing Allen in person, so I can fight him, bro. Allen's getting headlocked, bro. I still really don't think I ever saw Allen ever anywhere. I don't know. Like I, I was gonna give Wesley a headlock, but bro, when you see Wesley, Wesley the type of guy like you don't want to dap him too hard, or he might like break his shoulder or something. Top five people I want to headlock, Wesley. But I can't. Wesley's, like, too small to headlock. Like, he'll get hurt. Wesley. I really only want to headlock Wesley for 2K. It's not for Madden or anything. It's just 2K. Playing so much 2K with him, I just... Like that. Uh, who? I don't know. Bro, Earl... I can't make fun of Earl. I was I just had a crazy joke. I just had a crazy joke for Earl about that. Bro, I had a I, and I held back because I'm a, I I you know you can't poke you can't poke every bear. You know what I'm saying? Some bears just don't know how to take it. You got I mean I had a crazy joke. Bro, that joke might have been my top 10 jokes right there, really. One, I really have no reminder of ever playing you in MCS, but I'm glad you remember it. That's when you know you made it. When people remember playing you and you don't remember them at all. You know, that that's when you made it. You know what I'm saying? Top five up. I need to ask you guys about the streamers. Yo, last time. This is what happened. I, last time I asked. Last time I asked. the Last time I asked the chat who's their up and coming streamers. Everybody just said me. Me. It's like, all right. Nah, Allen's a sweat, bro. I ain't got time for Allen, bro. I want like kick Allen in the balls. Y'all ever kick anybody in the balls? I never did it. It looks powerful though. It looks powerful. It looks powerful. Man, it's a scumbag move. But it always works in the movies. Doesn't it always work? I'm gonna put I'm gonna put one uh, D Live. I got you. I, I know what I'm gonna do. I've been I've been got a lot of ideas for these next three days of Madden. Here goes you. You want to see 14 different answers? When does Madden come out? Talk to me, chat. <laughs> Dude on YouTube was no. Dude on YouTube was like no. Madden doesn't come out on Thursday. It comes out the 25th for the pre-order. I was like, okay, my bad. <laughs> my bad. Jesus, Brax, stop it. Alright. Alright, well, YouTube, this was the Needle Podcast, episode 94. We talked about a whole bunch of stuff. The links for the game ourselves below. Free trial. You can get a free 1 million percent free 99. Type in Needed US free. I just check out. You get these for free. This is two servings. Boom. Nothing wrong with free. Like I said, you can use the Needed. Need it at the discount. You get any purchase you want, 10% off. This is a hundred servings, a hundred drinks. Like I said, Players Lounge as well. Check that out below. Those links are below. Make sure you get your money games in because now is the best time because people suck. People like Juan are on there donating money, just running the ball, running the ball and pressing spin a million times.
you know so check that out i appreciate you guys watching this on youtube also man if you're on youtube listen leave your cash apps or your paypal below if you have made it this far on the youtube leave them below i'm gonna bless a couple of y'all man for supporting the podcast we are closing in on 100 episodes if you have any ideas for the 100th episode i'm all ears because right now i have zero but that's why i'm the host i'm going to come up with some before what six weeks two months there it is 